What's up guys? So delayed mass production due to Samsung Electronics 3 Nano Air. Possibility to apply only its own semiconductor this year. Not yet released but already in short supply. Samsung faced problem when creating a new flagship Galaxy S23 Ultra smartphone. But before the release of even more than 6 months in early 2023, Samsung will introduce a new generation of its flagship line the Galaxy S23 and although there is still time before this movement, information about problems in the production of devices is already appearing. According to all Korean clients from the business post, Samsung is experiencing a number of problems with a production of chipset. For the new generation of flagship, at the same time, the company plans to launch mass production of new Exynos chipset in the near future. And right now, the technological node responsible for the production of 3nm chips in showing poor performance. One way out of this situation is to reduce to share Exynos chips or sold of third-party smartphone manufacturers. Instead, the Korean ID gen can focus solely on its own equipment. All this in the end can lead to the fact that the Galaxy S23 will be a scarce device at the very start. According to another source, Samsung usually get a lot of flag from consumers for using two different chipsets in the high-end smartphone. And this year was no different, the company even had to face some bad luck as neither the Exynos 2200 nor the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 showed considerable performance improvement it now being reported that the South Korean film could bring a radical change with its upcoming flagship smartphone. According to a new report coming out from Korean Samsung could USA MediaTek processor in the Samsung Galaxy S22 FA and Galaxy S22 basic model. Until now, the company had used only Exynos or Qualcomm processor in its high-end phones. If the report is correct, this would be the first time the company is switching to a MediaTek processor for its new flagship S9 smartphone series. That's it. For now, for more updates, please subscribe to our channel Technology in the Future. Until the next video, take care of yourself. We will meet you in the next video. Bye-bye.